Hey everyone, welcome back to Cracked Open. Today we're opening up the True Steel Premium Collections. So, in this premium collection, you get promos that aren't really good. And this one's okay, it does a lot of damage, but, uh, but I think my favorite part are the toys. Oh, I love toys. I love putting them on display. I love it. My Pokemon display is going to be great one day, all these toys. Anyway, so these are the Zacian packs, these are the Zamazenta packs, and we're just going to see who's better. We'll start with Zacian. Thank you for joining the video. Hopefully you've enjoyed the massive amount of content so far, thanks to Darkness and Blaze. And this pack's a good pack to start, at least. Whoops. Or it could be just be bad hollow. I don't know, we'll see. Heat energy's good. I'm looking for some really good Darkness and Blaze cards for the store. Can't complain, I guess. Decidueye's okay. Heat energy's okay. Tangles fun card. What are we gonna get? Uh, nothing. All these packs are just not good. I'm not even gonna pull that up. Sword and Shield. Sword and Shield. We don't need too much from this set, but you know, some nice pulls would be nice, as always. Like a Secret Rare Zacian or Diamantenta would be very appropriate for this video. So one can only hope. Celebi V, did not notice the thing. Uh, this is very bad. Oh gosh. Nope. Team Up. This is fun. I've never opened a Team Up pack before. So, uh, don't really know what I'm looking for. Maybe some like Full Art or Hyper Rare. Zach Grump Pikachu action would be fun. I don't really know. I don't know this set off the top of my head. So, we're gonna get surprised together. Hopefully it'll be something amazing. Uh, ah. <laughs> Another Celebi. Really? Is this any good? Uh, after Pokemon is burned, poisoned, that's, that's overkill. See, not really, because there's so many switching cards in the meta. It's just makes effects like those almost kind of irrelevant unless, you know, you do them and it's just enough. But then it, it might as well just be an attack. Burning Shadows. I swear. Pokemon Company must have a lot of the Burning Shadows and Evolutions packs lying around. They have to. There's no reason for them to keep including them in all these things. Shining Kawa was nice. Uh, no. Rock was good back then, just not that one. The one that switched your opponent's Pokemon, very good. We're not gonna do the pack trick, and that's on top. I don't think that's supposed to be... Oh, we got a all foil pack. Oh, well, not really. The hell was that? Look at all those foils. Huh. What was the rare? Dugong? Wow. You know, that's unique. That's really nice. I was confused. But... Well, okay. Uh, anyway, I think... Well, that was a good... That was a good for Zacian. I mean, hits. But bad. Bad hits. I guess it's better no hits. Let's see if Zamazenta can give us some good Darkness of Blaze staples. That's really what we're looking for right now. Alright. Nothing in commons, nothing in commons, nothing. Second Darkness of Blaze pack. Sorry about the interruption, I thought someone knocked on the door. But no, it's just the Karate Kids. Um, in this office is also a dojo that also operates during nighttime. So it was like Karate Kids and they, I don't know what they do, Kung Fu or I don't, I don't know. I don't know what they do. No idea. Just some kind of martial arts. Oh, they, well, okay, well, well, that's bad. 
Darkness of Blaze packs are terrible. Terrible, terrible, terrible. You know, if we get a relevant card that's nice in the Soaring Shield or the team up, great. If we don't, then that's a sad. No. Got some good commons all commons. Marnie's nice. You know, that's like a $5 card, I think. That's fine. Good. Uh, team up. Alright. Again, I don't really know what's in this set too much. But, you know, here's hoping we get something really cool. Really cool? Really bad. Especially this is not removed. Jeez. Alright, uh, so... Marnie was the only good card we pulled out of our legal standard packs. Yep. Let's see. Can we at least get, you know, some something good in the Burning Shadows? Something nice and shiny? Maybe. Maybe something nice? Huh? That's not nice. It's like a floodgate. But I don't think anybody played that back in the day. Probably because of stage two. Can't remember if we had giant or forest plants or forest giant plants, if that was banned. Alright, evolutions. Not a god pack this time. Can we just get one good pull? Nothing. Beedrill. Alright, Dashing one. Straight up. You know, grass for the win. Marnie's not good enough. That's okay. And I got the god pack, I guess. So this video was actually really short, so we're gonna open up one more. Um, hope that the third one is the charm because like the first two are all just terrible Except for the really cool god pack and the one I and mean, then like that's it And that's not even worth anything. That's just like cool points. Like I'm a cool person for pulling that stuff So yeah, one more Two Zassians. We'll leave these ones here. They'll just for support. I think this time we'll start with the older ones and work our way up. See how that goes. Burning Shadows, Evolutions, we go like that. And we go like this, and we go like this. Okay. Awesome. I'm trying out this new camera angle. It's it's um, a lot higher up than it usually is. I want to see if I like that more. I may or may not. I don't know. All right. Let's get some good posts out of this box, please. Please. Nothing. First pack is a dud. What's even the rare? Doug Trio? Uh... All right. First pack, not so hot. Let's see if Burning Shadows is gonna be well. Seriously though, if I've opened up like half of these by the end, and there's nothing good coming out of any of the three I got. Besides the one box, which I guess had pulls. But the other people should just buy the other three. Because <laughs> it's amazing. Dark Rye. I don't know if I can count that as a pull. It was decent back in the day, but we're not back in the day anymore. Uh, team up time. Still have a very little idea what's actually in this set. So I don't know what I'm looking for. Just hopefully we put something shiny and good. Something meta relevant. Preferably. A little zebra. Uh, come on. Oh my goodness. Pidgeot. It's got free retreat with the stage 2 and actually terrible. So, uh, okay. Sword and Shield. I haven't been doing the pack trick. Maybe we'll do the pack trick. Maybe the pack trick will bring us uh, luck. Let's see if the pack trick can bring us luck. Uh, no. No, definitely not. Nope. Two more. Now we're on Darkness Ablaze. If I need hit, hits anywhere, it's Darkness Ablaze. We need, we need the Darkness Ablaze hits. Just need them. Lots of meta-relevant stuff. Just, come on. Anything. Anything. Bird Keeper is cool. Probably the best card we've pulled. 
No loose packs. Oh no. This straight up could be the worst true steel premium collection opening on the internet. I need something right now. Something. Can't even open it. Just give me anything. Some ultra rare something. Uh, oh my god. Well, there you have it. This was officially the worst True Studio Premium Collection opening on the internet, I think. I don't think it beats that, but you know, you can't, you can't hit them all. Just can't do it. Thank you guys for watching this video, and you guys take care. We'll see you next time.